perfect that fits into the hollow of a cheekbone. You don't, you really don't see anything like this in the makeup community, in, in many communities. Maybe you don't believe in love at first sight, but for me, it was real. They're so luxurious. They are so soft. The the bristles are so soft. It's really high quality. It just blends eyeliner like a dream. Seriously, I have five of these right now in my setup. I use it for foundation, cream, powder, contour, everything. These are probably the best essentials you could have in one set. I know we're often bombarded with several brands. You need this brush for that purpose. You need two for this purpose, three for this purpose. We want that one brush that's gonna do it all for us so we could go to work on time, but still look flawless. You don't need 10 eye brushes to do a soft, smoky daily eye. You can use one and it's still gonna look beautiful. I feel there was so much thought put into these designs to make sure that all these multifunctional purposes were covered everywhere from complexion to eye. And I believe that every makeup artist should have these in the setup because with these five core brushes, you can really do pretty much anything. And when you have amazing quality, it will last you for, for a very long time. Over the year, you can buy hundreds of $2 brushes, but will they last you? The name of our company, Refer, actually comes from the word reference, in that we rely on feedback from and the input from the community, like pros and beauty enthusiasts, to design beauty products. We're three engineers, you know, trying to tackle beauty, right? Which makes no sense, because none of us know how to do makeup. So we did the only thing we knew how to do, which was listen to the community. We did that mainly through a prototype program, where we actually got samples of brushes, what we thought were good brushes made, and then we sent them out to thousands of people that literally you just try the brushes and give them your feedback and that's all they want from you as an artist. They want your feedback and after they try it, they fall in love with it. One of the most unique aspects of Refer not only is gaining feedback, but how they've been getting that feedback and it's that they've been sending out prototype brushes. And I've heard over and over again, like, thank you so much for referring me to Refer. These brushes are amazing. You know, what this company is doing is amazing. It's really groundbreaking. It's, you don't, you really don't see anything like this in the makeup community, in, in many communities. So soft. This number four brush has been one of my absolute favorites. Like, I really want to pick up a few more of these because I think it would also be good for contouring and highlighting. The hairs are very, very smooth. They're very silky. And like most goat hairs, picks up product really, really nicely. It lays it down beautifully. It's not patchy at all. Just does a really, really good job uh, blending product out. So I really enjoy this number five brush as well. The bristles are a little bit more firm and structured um, while still being very, very soft. I just go like this in little circles and it doesn't get too high and it doesn't get too low and it buffs it out really really nice because again they're slightly um, more firm uh, bristles but they're still really soft. This is the flat shader brush. I, I love this brush. I think this shape to me is like the most versatile because I feel like I can put you know shadow down and I can also blend it out uh, in different shapes you know if I just lay it down a little bit flatter I blend it out in a wider space I can get really narrow with it if I just use the tip this is an amazing brush I love the size of it is perfect not only for applying that color on the lid but also applying on the lower lash line it's just incredibly smooth and again not only like I mentioned on the lid but if you wanted to pack on an intensifying shade on your outer view on the inner V, you could achieve that with this brush. But I think what I like about this is since the bristles are a little bit longer, the hairs are a little bit flexible, more flexible at the end than a lot that I have and use. And so it's just a little bit softer. Sometimes pencil brushes can be a little bit like hard on the lids. And I like that this one feels very soft and silky, uh, yet I get a nice like precise line. We had no preconceived notions of what makes a good makeup brush. And I think that's our advantage. 
It really allowed us to lean in and listen to the community. A lot of people thought we were crazy for doing this, but we saw that as the only solution in how we can come up with a really, really good product was through that prototype program. The town of Kumano has a very long and rich history. The Japanese word food day is for handcrafted brushes. And that has been a tradition to this town over the past 180 years. There are about 2,000 brush artisans currently living in the town of Kumano. So you can have like families that has been making brushes for generations. And that is why that this town is treated almost like a national treasure in Japan. I personally have never, like never seen this kind of dedication and passion to a craft like that anywhere else in the world. Each brush takes around two to four months to make end to end because like they obsess over every single little detail and that is why we decided to make our brushes there because we know for a fact that anything that they produce is going to be world class. As engineers, we've been trained to always be efficient in what we do. So our theory was that beautiful makeup can be applied by just using a few well-crafted brushes. The core collection is a set of five doodle brushes that anyone can use to do an entire look with. Each brush is crazy soft, they perform beautifully. What sets them apart is their maximum versatility. But we also know that makeup brushes is one of the most personal aspects of the beauty experience. Everyone's facial features and application preferences are completely unique. That's why we introduced the Bespoke Collection. The Bespoke Collection will allow people to substitute, replace, or add to their core collection to truly make it their own. This collection isn't intended to be a brush set in itself, but rather each brush is designed to address specific pain points that's been brought to our attention by the community. For example, brush 14 and 15 are designed specifically for people with hooded eyes. We first tested our bespoke collection through the prototype program. People loved it, especially pro artists. And this is why you'll see several pro features in the handles. And now that we have the perfect collection, production will begin in August and brushes will be in stores in December for the holiday season. But honestly, we really wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for all of the input and feedback from the community. So this is why we want to give back. We're opening up our production run today and allowing everyone to participate at wholesale pricing. These are our following offers. The core collection, which will retail for $168 in December, is $99 today. The Bespoke 5, which is your choice of any three eye brushes and two face brushes, retails for $185 in December, but will be available today at $110. And finally, the launch collection, which contains the corset, the bespoke collection, as well as the legendary number 11 powder brush, will retail for $570 in December. However, you get the entire collection today at $285. All orders placed today will be prioritized and shipped first before even our own inventory, where every single brush will be custom handmade by master artisans in Kumano, Japan. See you in stores in December. And if you like what we're doing and want more out of your makeup, join us on our production run today. And by the way, we ship worldwide and we'll have warehouses in both US and Europe. Thanks for watching until the end. You've actually stumbled across the bonus section of our Kickstarter campaign. Congrats! We're pleased to offer you the option to customize your handles in two different styles and four different lengths. This offer is exclusive only for people who've watched the entire video. So thank you so much for the support. Here's what you need to do. Let's say you wanted to order the core collection and customize the handles. Simply select the core collection and instead of pledging $99, add one more cent to your pledge to make it a total of $99.01. That way, we know you've gotten this hidden message. On June 30th, we'll email you asking what handle preferences you'd like and send your order to Japan, where it's custom handmade to order. Thanks again, everyone.